Microsoft Spam Reads Encyclopedia Dramatica. Logic and Reason. Logic and Reason is what happens when intellectually pubescent basement dwellers attempt to handle philosophical topics that rest beyond their limits of cognitive power. In short, they are the twin gods worshipped by the hardcore atheists that inhabit the piss containers of the internet. Due to its popularity among some of the lesser species of the internet, invocation of logic and reason is diagnostic criteria for determining whether an internet goer is a full-blown, self-filling pseudo-intellectual or just a standard douchebag. Or, I don't know the difference between humans and robots. Sometime within the past few years, a couple of misunderstood geniuses decided that Enlightenment philosophy had gone out of vogue 250 years too early. Instead of subscribing to the overwhelmingly held view that people perceive the world differently, they concluded that there was absolute truth to everything. Conveniently, these absolute truths matched up with the viewpoints that these brilliant minds already held. According to these individuals, the only way to see the world tilde clearly is with the help of empirical science and, of course, logic and reason, emotion be damned. Never mind the fact that human emotion and intuition are necessary for effective decision making, so much as suggesting this to a logic and reason devotee will cause their chins to quiver in anger. After all, they are scientists, because atheists obviously mean scientists nowadays who are you to challenge them. Logical and reasonable activities. Arguing with Christians on Facebook. self fellatio Accusing others of creating strong arguments. Fellating other logical and reasonable geniuses. Complaining about the friend zone. Creating image macros. Discreetly supporting eugenics. Minecraft. Using and accusing others of fallacious reasoning. Creating PL doctor rants about why they are autistic saviors from humanity's imminent stupidity. Bullying grieving families over memorial crosses. Because, you know, that's what secular humanism is all about. Enemies of logic and reason. Religious folks. Women. Republicans. Anyone without a degree in programming. The 1%. Americans who don't take their country. Agnostics. Vegans. Anyone over 30. Norps. That kid in middle school who called me a fag in the bus that one time. Non-militant atheists. Those apathetic about circumcision. Console gamers. Non-whites. Anyone who doesn't eat babies lol xd. Logic and reason in the wild. If you encounter somebody, non-ironically, worshipping logic and reason in the internet or elsewhere, your best option is to run away else risk receiving a fatal overdose of smug. If you do decide to point out the stupidity of following an outdated philosophy, be aware that you are fighting an uphill battle. These individuals lack the necessary self-awareness to realize that their viewpoints may be wrong and will always leave an argument feeling just as brilliant as ever. See also. Logic. Atheism. Read a book. I have a 140 IQ. Read the point key law and order. Trying too hard. Pseudo-intellectual. Smug. Anagogy Rikajwa is a faggot who has none.